So there is a show called 90 Days Fiancé. And there, there are a lot of people that somehow find themselves in this show. They get to meet someone online and they get introduced to this show. Cameras everywhere. Sometimes some people claim that there's a little bit of acting there, you know, the scripts that they have to follow. Um, since everything is now entertainment, when you go online, you, if you have a cable TV or on YouTube, they they have certain court proceedings that are on YouTube, and you see the old drama. A lot of things have become entertainment now. So, 90 Days Fiancé is also the same. Now, Nigerians are always involved in anything that is out there. As they no normally say, Nigerians don't carry last. Nigerians are reacting as Michael. Michael finally weds his much older white lover. Some might call the woman a Caucasian cowgirl. cowgirl. No. A lot of Nigerians have taken to social media to express their excitement, displeasure, as Michael finally, finally, finally ties a knot with Angela. Michael married the Caucasian darling, Angela, after the both tickled the fancies you know, of everyone around the world, as this was shown on a popular cable TV all over the world. The relationship, if we might use the word, survived many arguments, breakups, you know, sometimes um, friends of Michael claim that the woman is trying to dominate him, control him, speaks to him rudely and all of that. While some claim that the guy is just desperate and he needs to get out, probably he felt that that is his green card and all of that. Some claim that he does not understand, he feels that life for him is so bad or he cannot actually see the light and he thinks that this woman will take him there, not understanding what is tied to all of this. But then, who knows? The long-awaited wedding took place yesterday, 27 January 2020, along airport road in lagos a few days after the traditional wedding was held they had the wedding and 90 days fiancé took to their twitter handle to share photos of michael and angela at their colorful wedding ceremony with the caption michael and angela married 90 days 90 day fiancé now eventually michael will be traveling to the United States of America and, you know, eventually, you know, settle there and find his own way, find his own life over there. So we, we are going to quickly, I'm going to quickly show you guys some of the comments. I'm going to show you the Twitter handle of 90 days, 90 day fiancé and the pictures of Michael, as you can see. And of course, other reactions of Nigerians below. Here is a Twitter handle, and here the right be old. Michael and here the right be old. Michael and Angela married. Ninety day fiance. Um, well, some might come up with the age difference. Of course, this woman is old enough to give birth to Michael, and even old enough to be Michael's grandmother. Yes, Michael's grandmother, uh, because a woman can give birth at sixteen. And when you subtract the age and you look at the age difference, there's a possibility of this woman giving back to a person that will give back to Michael. And it's always like a common practice anyway, all over. You see certain, you know, rays, you know, get married to older Caucasian women for some reason or the other. Well, what's your own reaction to this too? You can drop that in your comment section. Do you live abroad? Have you experienced this? What's your take about this? Here someone says, Finally, oh, I don't want to say Michael, Michael, Makul, don't suffer, Sha. That's Michael, Michael, don't suffer, Sha. And that's a, a kind of expression in Nigeria and it carries a lot of weight. Another person say Angela weds Michael. And I want to say their love story funny though. Another person say Aye, Elei, Tipaje, marry woman way old like your mama, breast don't fall, Toto slack. Also, where is the pleasure farm? Fan. So that is what this person is really coming out with his own opinion as regards this union. Like, how can you uh, marry someone that is older than you? The breast is falling and a lot of issues here and there. You know, why would you do so? 
Uh, well, who knows? Who knows? You know, I, I don't know if Michael's mom really, you know, she's in support of this or she just has to listen to the boy. The boy say, Ma, this is what I need to do. And Michael, from his expression, really wants to go to America. And that woman is the green card to America. At least that is what he found. I don't want to say, what am I seeing? This is what someone here is saying. Another person say, baby, no, no, say, this old layer, now white trash, where they live off a good system. The debt, Baba won't go pay, where he rich Yankee, eh? Another person say, this boy don't carry Oyinbo trouble. I pity this guy. Now, do you think he has carried Oyinbo trouble? Another person here say, wow, I'm so happy for them. I love this couple. They are too much. Now, there's someone um, being positive about all of this. Here are the pictures of the wedding, as you can see. This is Michael behind, actually holding on to his property. And, or maybe the woman is now, Michael is now the woman's property, whatever it is. But that's just it. And this is both of them, you know, declaring to themselves whatever they need to declare to themselves. And as you can see, um, that is the camera. And Michael is here with his mom. His mom is also there. And the woman brought someone also that stood for her, you know. As a for, you know, this is a minister of the interior, Federal Republic of Nigeria, marriage registry. And that's what they did. You see the cameras everywhere and all of that. So the the cable TV that actually sponsored all of this also made money and they are still making money. So what are your own thoughts about this? This is Michael in you know taking pictures with his American wife, with his American wife and Michael is on his way to the United States of America. What do you think are the reactions of Michael's mom to this? Is this just about mom? I'm going to America. Don't worry. Give me this opportunity. I want to go to the United States of America. I've ever dreamt of going to America. Um, I'm going to do whatever it takes. I want to go there and all of that. What's your take about all of this? Now they are married. They are going to submit the documentations to the... In fact, they don't need to do much because the TV network that hosted all of this, that's sponsoring all of this, is going to put in their documentations and everything. And Michael will be giving a visa and he will be traveling to the United States of America and he's going to be on the marriage green card. He's going to be on the marriage green card. How is it going to be marriage green card? How is it going to be over there in the United States of America? We don't know yet what is really going to happen to Michael, but I'll keep you guys um, posted. Now, Someone here says, hopefully Michael knows the enormity of what awaits him with an older and controlling woman, wife, who has a daughter hostile to him, six grandchildren, and a near bed reading mother. He needs more than luck to maintain his sanity in such an environment. That's what someone is saying. The woman is much more older. The woman is dominating, domineering, controlling. And the woman has a daughter that is hostile to Michael because the... Other lady knows that on a good day, Michael is supposed to be with someone like me. At least age difference of eight, nine is not a problem. Michael is supposed to be with someone like me. Age difference in between. But the difference between Michael's age and that woman's age is, is enormous. So six grandchildren, that is what this woman has. Now, another person say Michael knows what he wants. I be when I think say he day is it for man to carry this kind of person she be now on the complaint michael is aiming for a brighter future so that is what it is as someone here is actually expressing his own view and now someone now asked and put a question i want to put the same to you he said if they ask you to marry this lady here in nigeria will you complain she's too fat old what of this one you marry with no shape uncle or no money so that's what someone here is saying that if this lady is available in nigeria would you have, of course, we know that people go with sugar mommy, sugar daddy, and all of that. Would you have married that person? Would you have married because there are things that people do abroad, but they will never do it in their country. There are things that people do. Yes, like I said, people go with other women, go with this, go with that for one purpose or one reason or the other. People choose, of course, in life. But would you have done the same? Sometimes when you see pictures abroad, you see, you know, very younger men. They are with very older white cowgirls, white cowgirls, white you know, you know, Caucasian cowgirls, older women, you know, a lot of circumstances anyway. So you see them doing the same thing. Now, another person say that this is a distorted story. Who is Michael? Who is Angela? What are the age differences? Well, whatever it is, what is the age differences? 
Now, another one say, this is where poverty has dragged many to, but those that know God will take solace in him. Frustration can push a man against his will, even when it hurts. Now, I'm going to leave it at this point, what this person has said. Do you agree that frustration, poverty, or low self-esteem, or low men uh, poverty mentality, because Michael may not be that poor, 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 but he's, he thinks and he believes that he can have it much more better in life, very, very much better in life. Maybe if he has the opportunity to go to the United States of America and maybe try try whatever it is that is out there. So that's what this person is saying, that poverty has dragged many to take certain decisions, get them into certain decisions, even when it hurts them, even when it is frustrating. That's what it is. I'm going to leave it at this point. What's your own opinion about this? Do you live abroad? Your family live abroad? You've heard stories? Let us let us hear it. Share it in the comment section. And why are that? If you're not a member of this channel, let us greet together by you tapping on the subscription button and the red notification icon bell below. Um, it will alert you whenever videos are uploaded. And if you're already a member of this channel, I say a very big thank you for the support.